So, Nadine Ross. Don't talk to me. I was gonna say, you look good. Was I not clear? What's that smell? Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't exactly had access to running water and soap recently. God. All the people you could have brought with you. <laughs> She saved my ass more than once, you know. You do remember that uh, she also tried to kill Nathan and I many, many times. And to be fair, you two tried to do the same to her. Uh, yeah, but it, that's not the point. The point is that the second we turn our backs, there will be a knife in there. I can hear every word you're saying. I know! I trust her. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I guess I'm just a little bit irked that we are walking away with nothing. But I guess you know what that's like, right? <laughs> oh, my. Real classy, thank you. Time and place, children. More that came from. Bike racks after school. Ugh. Just hurry up. The kings have one final test. Looks like you won't be needing us, though, so we'll just be on. Oh, on day. the contrary. Surely you know the story. <laughs> you see, Shiva gave Parashuram the mighty axe that struck Ganesh in the face, bringing Shiva's son, one of the greatest of the gods, to his knees. Another casualty of war. Don't. Yeah, seriously, Chloe, he's just gonna go! Uh, he's right. But if you refuse, you will watch them die inch by inch. All right! <laughs> Chloe, don't! Sharama. Chloe, don't you give this schmuck what he wants. Quiet! Testing my patience. Thank <laughs> you. 
yielding. It's going to fall. Quiet! Ganesh, quite an obstacle you've placed in my path. Chloe! You sure that's it? No. What are you doing? Shut up and watch. He yielded. Huh? Are you all right? Here. Yeah. That was unexpected. Holy shit, she's got balls, huh? I don't know. I don't understand. It's an idiom. That's because you've got it all twisted, my friend. Ganesh allowed himself to be struck by the axe. That makes no sense. Not to a selfish prick, no. You <laughs> see, Ganesh could have defeated Parashurama easily. But if he had, that would have made Shiva's axe look weak. Powerless. Ganesh sacrificed himself to preserve his father's honor. See, even she gets it, not a drop of Indian blood in her. <laughs> Magnificent, isn't it? Oh, what? Nothing to say now? Oh, if you like, I can tell you where to stick it. <laughs> well, my friends, I would love to kill you myself, but we must not anger the gods, for you have brought me a great fortune. Okay, then, what are you doing? I'm going to flood the chamber. I will miss you. Come on, is this really necessary? You know, nothing is ever truly destroyed. Only purified and reborn. Just shoot us and get it over with. Right. As the water fills your lungs, you will have time to reflect on the choices that brought you here. Perhaps in your next lives, you will fare better. Prick. I don't know about you guys, but I got a lot of regrets swimming around in my head right now. Well, tell me about it. I was really looking forward to kicking your ass again. Hey, you know, I'm not exactly thrilled about drowning next to you, either. Could you give it a rest, guys? I'm trying to concentrate. What are you doing? A little preparation goes a long way. Ha <laughs> ha, yes! Everyone good? <laughs> no 
getting waterlogged. Going <laughs> great. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta quit smoking. <coughs> Doc! Think they saw us? Let's hope not. How the hell did Asov get that helicopter? Maybe it's the buyers. What do you mean? Still over heard Asov talking about <coughs> heading to the old rail yard, something about an arms deal. He's selling the tusk. It's not much for preserving his culture. Hey, just a second. Listen, uh, <clears throat> back there. Thanks for... Professional courtesy. <laughs> of course. So, are we good? No. Yeah, I figured. If we hurry, we can intercept them before they make the sale. Huh. And there's our ride. Nice. There. Railroad tracks. Stop here. Uh. 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 I saw we'll have lookouts throughout the area. Best door on the side of caution. Right, right, right. And then we lose the tusk. You're welcome to stay behind. I'm if just you saying. Like. All right, all right, all right, right. Less talking, more walking. So all that time in Asov's care, and you couldn't get any intel on the bias? Uh, well, I tried. Asov's a cagey one. Almost never talks shop in front of me. <sighs> Can't imagine why. Hey, he trusted me enough to believe I was an expert in all this hoisala crap. Hoisala. Yeah, the two. By the way, thanks for keeping him busy for us. Yeah, you know, I wanted to buy you some time in case you were coming to get me. Of course we were. Seriously, thanks. I thought I was a goner. I wouldn't let that happen. Your brother would never let me hear the end of it. Found the train tracks, sort of. Kind of a shock seeing all these modern structures after the Hoysala ruins. Well, it looks either British or Portuguese, 1800s, not quite modern. Nadine. We're not on a first name basis. Okay, fine. I heard you worked for us off too. How'd, uh, how'd you deal with the torture? What? what do you mean? Did he torture you? Oh, yeah. Wouldn't stop talking about himself or his cause. It's like, I get it, man. You don't have to sell me on it. <laughs> I'm just here to make some scratch. I can't stand it when people prattle on incessantly. Yeah, I know, right?
go. This way. Copy that. Should have packed my machete. It'll help. No problem. Go ahead. You first. Much obliged. Wow. He can sort it out. Hey, thanks for not murdering Sam, by the way. He might prove useful later. There you go. Good. Positive attitude. He could act as a decoy, draw some fire away from us, throw himself on a grenade and save us all. a detour you coming uh, I would but the bridge here is a little busted so jump <laughs> I'm flattered you think I'm capable of superhuman feats but it's kind of far never know until you try sit tight Sam we'll get you across hey this might do the trick <gasps> holy mother of shit this is heavy One piece? Yeah. Go team! Come on. We're exposed up here. You know, I feel so much safer with her around. I never would have found you without her help, okay? Okay. She just wants to kill me, is all. Well, don't give her a reason to. Nadine, see if there's something up there we can use. I can do it. No, we're good. Come on, China, I'll give you a boost. All right, just trying to be chivalrous. Just watch him, man. Uh, yeah. oh, got it. You see anything up there we can climb on? Like a crate or something? <laughs> this should work. <laughs> huh. Nice. Got it. Come on up. Go ahead, Sam. Age before beauty. Oh, you're too kind. No. She's just worried I'd kick it over and leave you down there. Right. Uh, how about I scout ahead a little? 
I wouldn't really leave him. Yeah, well, play nicer. <laughs> Sam, see your way forward? Yeah, sort of. Ah. Well, uh, definitely need your grappling hook. Okie doke. On my way. I'll just borrow Nadine's hook and... I have a better idea. What are you... Up? Don't move. Ow, come on, hey. I said don't move. <clears throat> Unbelievable. Hey, <laughs> right, Chloe, can I borrow your rope? Of course. Me first, though. <laughs> don't mind me. <clears throat> Sorry. Yeah, 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 just leave oh. the rope for me, please. You got it. <clears throat> There's a cave up there. Might cut through to the tricks. I take it she's going first. Why don't you go ahead? Leave the rope for me. You got it. Next time, bring your own bloody rope. Heads up. What is this place? Light? Sure. All right, well, there's only a few of them. We can probably... What? That sub guy doesn't do things halfway. It's going to be quite a show. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Sure? What the hell are they doing there? We got rid of all these hey. Go ahead and just... <gasps> she said she was cool! No! 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 Did you like my own conversation? Yeah! Gold star for you!
Okay. I think that's the last of them. Uh, Nadine, can I have a word? What? Just following your example? Yeah, but... Come on. No way I'm letting anyone from Shoreline get the tusk. That RPG trashed the exit. Maybe, maybe not. Let's go see. Hmm. I think we can squeeze through here. <clears throat> Give me a hand. Coming. Fraser, you go first. Thanks. How you doing in there? Good. We're nearly to the rail yard. Shouldn't be long now. Necessary. Okay. Now then. Nearly to the rail yard. God's ball, she's alive. <laughs> Nadine, she's over here. Are you all right down there? Yeah, I was fine until Sam made me picture God's balls. Where are you? By the radio tower. Hey, do you see way up? Fraser, we'll find something you can hook your rope to. Ah, oh, sounds like a plan. Got something for you. The bracelet against that strut. I'm doing it. There. Okay. Come on up. Dirty enough. Thanks, you too. Well done. Yeah, not bad. Considering it was her idea. 